What if you made something that was so quiet that you need to be next to the singer to hear what it's about? That the sounds of the instruments are so tiny and fragile and so um, evaporative that if you're not there watching it happen, you won't know that it happened. The piece was actually commissioned by a group called ICE, the International Contemporary Ensemble, which has a home here at the MCA, and I've worked with them many times in the past. A fantastic, fantastic ensemble. The thought behind the Whisper Opera um, comes out of a very long-running series of thoughts I've been having about why we have live performance at all. I began in the live performance world, and if live performance is going to be meaningful, we need maybe to invent new reasons to keep it. What if you made a performance which was so intimate and so fragile and so um, personal that a recording couldn't capture it? I think one of the things that you can have in a live performance that you can't have on a recording is you can see the people struggle. You can see music that's too hard to be played. You know, No one is going to record a piece of music that has mistakes in it or isn't completely perfect. But in live performance, you actually see the people fight. So in a lot of the music that I've made, I've tried to make um, pieces which um, accentuate that fight, that struggle, so that you see that human element of someone trying to overcome something. Because the Whisper Opera is so quiet, not many people can see it at the same time. And the way the people see it actually is um, hugely important to the piece. The director and the designer of this piece is Jim Finley. Jim Finley is a longtime collaborator of the Worcester Group. Um, he's somebody who is a playwright, an actor, um, a builder, a designer, a lighting person, a video person. He's, he's someone who has, in his um, life, been called upon to um, have many, many, many different kinds of experiences in the theater world. And I've given him the charge in this piece to take these weird, intimate ideas and to make them as delicate and fragile and as intimate as possible. And I'm incredibly excited about what he's come up with.